basically today I'm going to do a um, stuff off Game Boy, stuff off the Amiga. For those who are familiar with the Game Boy, it's 1989 I think it was released. Um, this has been modified a bit, it's got a backlight in it, um, just so I can see it, otherwise I'd be like this for the whole time. Um, it's got a slightly dodgy jack, and I've also got the Amiga as well. What I'm going to do is play a track off this, then an Amiga track, which this is quite amazing. For those who haven't played with an Amiga before, it's from 1984 it was released, and um, it was the first home computer that had affordable digital sound on it. Um, and I try, my philosophy on Amiga is to try and make the sound pretty much like produce music if I can, so I try to push limits on this thing. Um, and I've also got stuff where I've remixed a Game Boy into the Amiga, which is the second or oh, third track you'll hear. Um, so I hope you enjoy it, and um, I've just got a chaos pad here to uh, be able to put some reverbs and things on. And without further ado, see how we go. This one's called Airs Rock. <laughs>
which I was supposed to finish before we got here. We've actually got a hundred of these printed without anything on the disc. Uh, we expected to burn it here and then unfortunately the guy I was splitting with um, uh, couldn't finish the track. So this will be coming out in a couple of months and I don't know, just have a look out for it. Um, this is a track which is possibly, this is the best setting I could possibly play it. It's called uh, Disco Demo Party.
And uh, great out to uh, Little Bitch, who actually wrote the original track on that. He's a demo singer with very big talents. That's, I think, all. Um, anyway, uh, I'm going to play one more track. Um, this is, I'm going to go back to the Game Boy. I thought we'd just calm down on something a little more uh, crazy. I was never thinking of playing this. Uh, this is a, a track. We have lots of competitions um, in the chip scene, as most of you guys know. And this was a, um, you had to make a track for a fighting game. Um, it's just like a, any, just make a fighting game sort of style. So I sort of chose an end level kind of thing. Um, yeah, and I hope you enjoy it. Carl thanked everyone, but thank you very much for the care for the visuals and, and the guys.